So what if you wanted to move the image inside this block? Okay, the first obvious thing you might want to do is move um, this image tag inside the division. Okay, let's see what happens. When I click on that, it moves here. Okay, now notice the difference. I have my paragraph and I have my image. Okay, now let's see the opposite thing. Not the opposite, but another way to do it is like I move the image before the paragraph. What's happening here? Okay, now this happened because image is an inline element okay it lets things come in the same line after after it okay so when you add the image first and then the paragraph the paragraph comes in the same line mind you also in my class here I mentioned that it is text align left okay that's why it is coming here and the image is on the right. One more thing that you would want to add in your code is the word overflow equal to auto. That means whatever is overflowing or the size different of the image is, the, the division automatically adapts to it. That's why you write the word auto flow, um, auto overflow equal to auto. Okay. And um, yeah, basically that. So you move the image inside here, but if you want it to be appearing in the same row as the text, you might want it to come before. And then in your CSS, you write the word overflow auto to let it come inside the text and appear there.